Hi, this is Stacy showing you a Wham Cart tip. We're going to go ahead and check out and purchase a, a product through PayPal. Um, I did go ahead and drop down the product to one cent um, for testing purposes. Let me go ahead and fill in my information. Okay, and at the very bottom it says payment method. Um, the payment option available is PayPal. We're going to go ahead and continue. Here I'm going to give, verify my customer billing information and the order information. Uh, we're going to be purchasing the search engine optimization for eBay users part one. And we're going to press continue at this point and it's going to take me directly to PayPal. PayPal is her payment gateway that she's using for all purchases. The first thing I want to show you is there's two options to pay in with PayPal. As most of us know right here is where you can log into PayPal. You can put in your email address and your password and you log into your PayPal account and you pay for it. The other option that most people are unaware of, and this is what I want to point out, is you can use any credit card or bank account and what you do is you press continue and you're, you basically stay on the outside of PayPal. You do not sign into a PayPal account. You enter in the credit card number, the expiration date, you verify your billing address, the home telephone number, the email address that you want to use, and then you click review order and continue and it will actually take you through and you're going to purchase the item. Now I want to sign into my PayPal account to not show you not only can I log in and pay through my PayPal account, but I can change my how I want my transaction to be paid. It's going to take me right to reviewing my payment. Um, you'll see here that my one cent is going to come right out of the PayPal balance I have. If you click on payment method change, you can also change it to come out of your checking or your savings account. If the balance was more than this, you would also see at this point that I could select a credit card for the transaction to be paid through a credit card. Just because the, the payment is so low that the credit card is not available as a, an item for me to select here. At this point, I'm just going to go ahead and click cancel, have it come out of my PayPal balance, and now we're going to pay now. This is the most important part any time that you purchase anything for, through PayPal. And if you are purchasing an item that is a digital delivery, meaning that you are going to download a guide, you need to click on return to and then whatever the company name is. In this case, return to boutique bargains alerts. I'm going to click on that. This is going to take me to the download page. If you close out, the only other way that you can get it is through your receipt. What I'm going to look at is click here to download SEO for eBay users part one. This is how I'm going to get the guide. The second way that you get the guide, this is my receipt for my purchase. Um, basically says, thank you for your purchase. If you have any questions, please reply to this email. Happy selling Jen at boutiquebargains.com. Order details, you get the product, search engine optimization for eBay users part one. The merchant name is Boutique Bargains and Beyond. Order number, which is the PayPal transaction receipt. Subtotal was a penny. The total price was a penny. Purchased by Stacy Jansma. Purchase date today. And that's her support email. This is the second way that you can get your guide. Click here to download SEO for eBay users part one. I would click on that and it would take me to download her, her guide directly and it's that simple so you have this all set up it automatically just works for you so Jen did not have to go above and beyond to tell PayPal that PayPal needs to sign into their PayPal account and make the choices that is just how PayPal functions um, so this is really just to show you how WAMCart works with PayPal it's not anything that you need to select within WAMCart other than telling WAMCart that you do want to accept payments by PayPal, and the rest of it just works for you. So it's really that simple. Get more tips at stacyjanzema.com slash whamcarttips. Thank you.